Zach Gallon on the mound to start this one. And Zach through four starts, unbeaten, the 1 2 7 ERA, outstanding. And how about that start? 95, he just blows it by <laughs> Connor Joe. And Zach Gallon pick it up where he left off last week against Miami. Right there with a heater. He caught Crone looking. Oh, that's what you were talking about. CJ Crone knows, okay, maybe here. Cutter, maybe change up. No, we got the fastball. He might chase that pitch if you throw it again. There it was. Close enough. Doubled up on the change. Gallon has struck out three, the first seven. Herrera sets up out there. And that's a fastball right down Broadway. Four strikeouts for Gallon through two. No score. D backs and the Rockies. Got him. It rolls away from Herrera. The curveball is the money pitch right there. 2 2. Went to the slider. Gallon gets strikeout number six. 2 2. There's another swing and miss on the curveball. Make it seven strikeouts for Zach. He's punched out three in a row. And that's a good start. That changeup's been a big pitch for Zach this year. Ooh. Right on the corner, Ted Barrett, who rings him up. Four strikeouts for Galley. Set down seven straight Cubs and leads it 1 0. Got the call inside. Suzuki knew it. Five strikeouts for Gallon, who set down eight straight. Allen, the longtime White Sox strength and conditioning coordinator. Gallon gets Hayward to bite, and that's seven strikeouts. Add up to getting into the seventh, eighth, or ninth. Swing and a miss on the fastball. Eight strikeouts through five for Zach Gallon in a 1 1 ball game. Goes back to the changeup, gets strikeout number nine. Right hander Zach Gallon on the mound for the Diamondbacks, who last Wednesday at Chase Field hit four of the first eight Cincinnati batters at a ball game, but then closed by retiring the final 16 he faced. Less than Sterling, let's just say, from the skipper. Big cut by Profar at that changeup, which just kind of hung up there, but he missed it. And it's two and two on Luke Voigt. Got him. Went right back to that change. Two swings and misses on that changeup, and Gallon has his second strikeout. I think so. This is a naval town after all. And Gallon gets a swing and a miss that time with a curveball, and he struck out three of the first five. Here is Eric Hosmer. Boy, Zach Gallon between the changeup and that curveball has getting a whole lot of swing and miss. Jorge Alfaro, the catcher. Gallon has four consecutive strikeouts and five in the ball game. Right at the knees with a fastball. And Grisham is caught looking. That's six strikeouts for Zach Gallon. And it might end up being Dallas Keuchel. We'll see. Oh, well, that's uh, maybe what they should have done with Luke Voigt. Big swing and a miss on the curveball. And Gallon gets strikeout number seven. Gets the swing and the miss that time. Went to the curveball one more time and make it eight strikeouts for Zach Gallen. Strikes out a bunch. The catcher Jorge Alfaro will punch out to lead off the third. Swing and a miss. Zach Gallen went to that curveball one more time. He's got nine strikeouts through four. Boy, Zach Gallen, I tell you what, between the curveball and that changeup, he's had it working tonight. That's 10 strikeouts. Swing and a miss. Went back to that curveball. That's a career high 11 strikeouts for Zach Gallen in just five innings. With Zach Gallen on the mound, who's 6 and 2 with a 3.31 ERA. Here's the pitch. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. And a good start for Gallen. Picks up strikeout number one. 2 2. Swing and a miss. And Newman down on strikes. Previous five outs on just seven pitches. He's really got it rolling right now. And he finishes off Marcano for the second time. Just dotted the fastball right there. He struck out Marcano twice. He was a little bit clunky, but boy, he's on point tonight. He's thrown some beautiful changeups. And that's three consecutive strikeouts for Zach. Very soon is the pitch swung on and missed. And down on strikes is Chavis. That's a half dozen for Gallon. Zach Gallon is dialed in tonight. That's seven strikeouts. The pitch swing and a miss. He struck him out. He lost the ball to Kelly. Now throws to first in time.
Puts another zero on the board for Zach Gallen. Zach is 3-0 in his last four starts. All four of those games, Diamondback win. Hilliard holds this time, and Nunez chases that high fastball. And that's the first strikeout for Zach Gallen. Punches it to the third base side for Rojas. And they turn the double play. As the pitch is swung on and missed, and McMahon is down on strikes. Catches Montero looking at a fastball. Right there with another fastball from Gallen. Three strikeouts in the inning. Five scoreless. He leads it 4 nothing. Straight heat gets the strikeout. That's five for Gallen. He has set down 13 of the last 14 Rockies. Ryan McMahon whiffs on the curveball, and for the third time in five starts, Zach Gallen has gone seven scoreless innings. Right there, a changeup, and Gallen rings up Wade to start it off. And what a start to this one. Back to the curveball, two batters, two strikeouts. And yes, he offered it the curve. Carson Kelly cleans it up. Gallen with three strikeouts. 3-2. Three, Got him. 3-2 to Yastrzemski. Fastball is right there. Zach Gallen. Five strikeouts through three. And he leads it 2 nothing. We, uh, as Lola Gory goes down on strikes. Wow. 60 pitches, 43 strikes. Crawford thinking about bunting with two strikes. And that takes care of Crawford. More quiet than they used to be. Well, he tied him up with that changeup. Zach Allen with nine strikeouts. He's punched out four the last five. Yes, he offered, says Dan Bellino. Zach Gallen strikes out the side. He has faced the minimum through six. He's punched out ten. Yes, he went, says Mark Ripperger, and Zach Gallen matches a career high. That's strikeout number 11. Goes bunt and bunts it foul. And Zach Gallen stretches his consecutive scoreless inning streak to 21. He has set a new career high with a dozen strikeouts. 5-0 in his last six starts. Zach begins this game with a consecutive scoreless streak at 21 and a third innings. Only threw that curveball, and Carson Kelly cleans it up. Good start for Zach. I think he would rather outthink you than just flat out beat you. Curveball. Boy, he got the whole Magilla right there. Second strike out for Gallon. Every club in the bag. Hammer every quadrant of the plate if he wants. And another swing and miss on the pitch by Massey. And there's one out in the fourth. Third strike out for Zach. And then and that one is definitely there. Isbell is rung up. Two strikeouts in the inning for Gallen for the ball game. Work four scoreless. The scoreless inning streak is up to 25 and a third for Zach Gallen. Called strike three. Put that four seamer right there. Five strikeouts for Zach Gallen. It's me against you. There's another one. It seems Candy to be helping him find some kind of rhythm or tempo. And they've got the right-hander Zach Gallen on the mound tonight. Opens up exposing those hands and wrists. 395 pitches. And gets stubbed to chase a high fastball for strikeout number two. There goes Marsh. Got him. Right on the corner. And there's a whole team behind him. And Gallen has got five strikeouts. Swing and a miss. There's the cutter. Gallon has six strikeouts, six scoreless innings, make it 33 and one third without a run. And of course, he had the truncated 2020 season. There's another strikeout for Zach. Second time he's got Hoskins. Harper has struck out, grounded out. 0 for 2. Bryce Harper backs up Varsha in right field, and he's got it. Nice. 34 and one third consecutive scoreless innings, a seven pitch seven. And we'll see if Zach Allen can keep this thing going. It's been a remarkable run, a scoreless inning streak at 34 and a third. Gallen really liked the curveball in that sequence. Gets his first strikeout. 
And he waves at a curveball. The streak is still alive for Zach Gallen. And he leads the Brewers 2 0. Carson Kelly hangs on the changeup. Gets Gallen his third strikeout. Zach Gallen, there's that Gallen changeup, and he has recorded three consecutive strikeouts. Caught looking, Zach Gallen strikes out the side in the fifth. He had thrown 57 innings and given up four earned runs. 3 2. Carson hangs on, strikeout number six for Zach. Got him! Zach Gallen has set down 11 consecutive Brewers. He's got seven strikeouts and has thrown 41 and one third consecutive scoreless innings. The second longest consecutive scoreless inning streak in Diamondbacks history, trailing only Brandon Webb. Got him! And Zach Gallen has matched Brandon Webb's Diamondbacks record, 42 consecutive scoreless innings. He's got one more to get. Swing and a miss. There's the strikeout, and there's the new record. Zach Gallen, a new Diamondback record. 42 and one third consecutive scoreless innings. And Zach Gallen gets Blackman to chase that curveball, and Gallen has recorded three consecutive strikeouts. So he has not at all been phased by this environment, and he has struck out four consecutive Rockies. Strikeout number five, eight up, eight down for Zach Gallen. Wing and a miss. Zach Gallen, six strikeouts through three, make it 44 and one third consecutive scoreless innings. Well, Gallen just sticking with curveballs and finally got Blackman with a curve. That's seven strikeouts for Zach. Fastball right there, spotting that fastball for called strikes, and that's eight strikeouts for Zach Gallen. Got him. Three strikeouts in the inning, nine in the ball game for Gallen. And the ten strikeouts for Gallen. Boy, Zach Gallen strikes out Blackman for the third time. Gallen with 11 strikeouts. 12 and three, an earned run average that is top five in the National League. Jim Wolf says strike three. Trey Turner caught looking at a fastball. Sticks with that curve, and Zach Gallen has retired all six he's faced. He struck out two. We are scoreless after two in LA. And Zach really tied him up that time. Gallen threw the fastball by him. Three consecutive strikeouts for Gallen. Two outs in the third. You betcha. Mm -hmm. Four consecutive strikeouts for Zach Gallen. He's punched out five of the first nine. Boy, Zach Gallen runs that fastball in there. It's five consecutive strikeouts for Zach Gallen. And Gallo will take the strikeout. That's his second tonight and the seventh for Zach Gallen. Oh, boy, Zach Gallen's got it going again. Another curveball, another strikeout. That's eight for Zach. Oh, for and Bellinger cannot check. Back to the curveball, and Gallen has struck out nine. There it is, Zach Gallen. Strikeout number 10. He rings up the red menace, Justin Turner. Two and two on Gallo. Swing and a miss. Got him, Zach Gallen. Has matched a career high with a dozen strikeouts. Struck him out, Zach Gallen, 13 strikeouts, a new career high.